Split River Junction Battle Axe Psalms by Paul E. Bedard. It was long ago, it was a long ago starry night when and where the drumming bearers of Portent and Prodigal came to their ungoverned and circumvented decision. The time itself was of a non-linear, lost and found climate elemental walk among and along the lost roads into and out of the scientine arts of twice pounded twice pounded mallet last and first of these were the north landing and savagely nomadic wanderers of the ever watching steeps these rugged terrains were filled with dark and endlessly tunneled caves, as if the dusk perfumed myth bearers. The outside world knew to be helmsmen and woman temporarily home from otherworldly climatudes, erudite in the wealth of the long nights, endless in torp temperament. The steep landers were governed, leagued, and last of all, legended and numbered among shield and wielding sword, shield and wielding sword, born into existence through the mighty forge of fearless metal. Definition, conceptuality, and encyclopediacity, besides three higher forms of word-for-word -word hierarchical understanding, had achieved translucency, material existence, uh, translucency, material existence and six and the six could be seen almost nightly walking in and out of stone lit gardens darkly interior portrait hung and intricate layered labyrinths and god kept gates before old half ruined gossamer chambered homesteads motion and stillness being one lit one another's candle wicks looking with dante-esque eyes into airy rooms where within sculpted men sitting in chairs around ornate tables slowly drew breath and began realizing portent life within themselves